Mufasa, you know we're finally here, right? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's new car day! It's new, new, new car day! Welcome to the video. Today is a big day. Why is it a big day? Well, it's obvious because the title will tell you why it's a big day. Are you excited? Yeah. She's been waiting like two or three weeks for all of this to all the paperwork to go through. But you've been waiting years for this car. Yeah. This, years. <laughs> this is Ellen's. Well, you've got two dream cars, haven't you? When I got with her, there was two cars that she always said she wanted. This was on the list. And you're fine. In the colour as well. In the colour she wanted. And the spec. Yeah. Yeah, so it's coming today. What time is it? Bit of a pinch me moment now. It's coming at 12. It's currently half 10. Obviously, in the current climate, you can't test, test drive a car. So I've bought a car that I've never seen before. <laughs> no, she's had a video of it come through, but um, it's three hours away, isn't it? It's in Hull. It's traveling. So it's in Hull. The couriers are really busy. So the person who sold it to me, the um, salesman, is actually driving it from Hull. Absolutely awful. It's raining, which is not ideal conditions to buy a car in. Do you know why it's not ideal conditions to buy a car in? It's slippy. No. What? Not that, because the rain hides scratches and Yeah, stuff. I know. We've got to like work out, because I want to look around the car, but I hate like looking around things when people are like staring at me. So, if you distract them by making them a cup of tea... <laughs> okay. <laughs> we weren't off to a very good start this morning. Why is that, Al? You told me off, didn't you? Bring it up. Come on then. Let me why tell did, you why, why it's travelled in my bad books. So this week I've been on half term, but do you know what I've been spending my half term doing? Let me tell you. I've been spending <laughs> my half term washing up washing up that's already been washed up. Because Fab thinks this oh, God. is acceptable. Alright. Oh god, that's embarrassing. Okay. Right, I have got there is reasoning for this. I've accept fault. It's terrible washing up, but I left the washing up until late last night. I had a busy day at work. I was actually at work. Came home right before bed. Ellen's like, you got that washing up to do. So I did it quick time, but obviously I missed it. That's terrible though. You're okay, really, I apologize. I'm not gonna make people feel sorry for you because did you have time to go on your Xbox last night? That's part, yeah, but that's important. You leave soap suds on the washing up. She doesn't rinse the soap off. Well, at she least puts the fairy liquid the on bowl. the plate. Scrubs it and then chucks it straight into the... What are you doing? But Does anyone else do that? Let me ask the question here. What? Whose washing up is cleaner, mine or yours? Yeah, but yours tastes like suds. But whose is cleaner? Okay, look at that. Washing up all done <laughs> and dried. Now though, I need to clean all this kitchen area. Well, that's the kitchen, nice and clean. I feel a lot better now. I'm gonna have a coffee. Al, do you want a coffee? Okay. Yeah? That is so satisfying. It's Dewey, what's that song? It goes, do, 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 do. <laughs> You know there's actually, there's socks on you. I know, I thought you they know, were there's, yours. There's actually, no, they oh, they're yours. mine, they're mine. Okay, memory of a goldfish. You know there's actually a function on like Google, or there's an app where you can sing the song and it tells oh, you. Oh yeah, there is, isn't there? there Cheers. Cheers. Here's to a new car. <laughs> Fab likes really expensive coffee. Ellen, it's not expensive coffee And at I all. like from cheap Aldi's. instant coffee. Mine is two pound and Ellen's is a pound. She has instant coffee. I'm sorry, but if you drink instant coffee, what are you doing? Just quick, this, easy This life, is so much nicer, like, how, try that. How long did it take you to make that coffee? An hour, but that's how it's quite now. So normally I have this this one on it on my belt on this hole. I got it on this hole today and I was a bit tired, I have to tell you. <laughs> so Elle's just on the phone to them now. They are literally down the road. I'm excited and nervous at the same time. I hope she likes it because this is the first time she's actually seen it in person. Pretty sure she's going to like it. She's seen video walk around of it and everything like that, but it is raining. So we're going to have to be extra careful that we check around it, make sure there's no scratches or anything like that. They're here. I'm not going to film it or show you once we've sorted everything out. I don't know if you can tell. Will they be able to tell by the inside of this? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe you can tell already. You can probably tell from the thumbnail, to be honest. But Elle's just taxed the car and everything. What a and that was. I know, she was stressing out. We're in Asda's car park. Are you going to show them around, Elle? 
Okay, are you ready? Count them in. Three, two, one. Boom! Yes! This is my new Audi Q3. It's an S-Line Plus. I've got to get that in there. Looks sick though, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, It's yeah. in, what's the colour? Pearl white. Pearl white, and it looks Which beautiful, is, doesn't it? So if anybody knows me, I've always banged on about how I want a white Audi. It's got like the black trimmings, are they called? Trims. Yeah. Yeah, wow, well, the grill, the because it's got the black, um, the gloss black grill here, rather than it, a lot of them are chrome, so like the grill will be chrome, but this is gloss black, and I think it looks way more aggressive. Yeah, nice, huge, big wheels. It's got the little S-Line badge here that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then back of the car, I'm going to have to show them with the indicator. Looks so smart, Al. So another reason why I got this car is because it has got the black out windows. Oh that yeah. Was a big thing for me when I was looking for the car. So it was a really. It looks a really cool, doesn't it? Big thing. I like this as well that it's got the black here. Yeah. Nice black trim really on nice. the back. Big window on the back. Do you want to open yeah. the boot up? Oh ho! -ho! Automatic pretty. boot huge boot yeah i'm assuming good. that this thing you pull out yeah you can do yeah oh yeah nice yeah and then look at this so this is how you close the boot just reach oh that was close oh my god you're a proper adult now you've got an automatic boot inside so this is the inside it's got like this like velvet stuff here alcantara it's called oh that's really nice yeah and then steering wheel yeah which is nice it's the s line got the s-line on the seats and you'll laugh at this what but look i'll move the seat to where i sit so this is me sitting in the car okay <laughs> <laughs> i have to sit so close and my feet like dangle down yeah. it looks lush though Al. and it's got five doors which is what i wanted so oh, yeah. now you can just get in the back without having to clamber over yeah you happy yeah it's like you wouldn't believe i can't quite believe that it's real i have a feeling like in a minute i'm gonna wake up from a dream <laughs> You deserve it though. That is the car. That is our new car. Technically it's Al's car, but I'm on the insurance as well. So any chance I get, I'm going to be driving this Al. If you've clicked on this video just because you wanted to find out about the car, then hopefully you'll stay and watch the rest of it. But if not, see you later. We're going and doing the only exciting thing that you can currently do in lockdown, food shopping. Yeah. So this is our weekly sort of, I actually used to despise food shopping but now I don't mind it so that's a big step in Secretly, the right direction. you love the food shop. You've got plenty of room in this boot now I know. for shopping. Oh my god yeah we can fit loads of stuff in here now. Yeah. We need to go to Ikea when it's open because yes. just because we can fit loads of we stuff We can in do here. the click and collect thing. We might do a click and collect oh, yeah. Ikea video where we like order stuff online go and get it because there are some bits we want. Whenever we come down this road it always brings us some nostalgia because on the right hand side in a second just this next turn in here these are the flats that we used to live at before we had our house that big building there is the flats that we used to live at and ideal because you had this big retail park which had like lots of good shops on there but then dangerously down here you had kfc just and there the yeah and then across oh, the roundabout crispy chicken. i just missed that i just missed that <laughs> Yes, we finally found some wine that both me and Ellen like. Is it red wine? Yeah. Ellen, Al, can you please not fart like that in public? Why did you do that? That's oh my God, that stinks. No, stop it. Stop. <laughs> you dare. No, not, you're not doing it again. No, it. Oh my God. No. Ellen, that absolutely stinks. <laughs> <laughs> We have returned from shopping and it's still extremely rainy and crap outside and the time is now quarter to five. Yeah. Shit, that's gone quick. I know. Should we show our fridge now that we're all socked up? Go on then. Go on then. Ta-da! Ta-da! Here we go. We, got, we always put our eggs on the top and our cheese, kind of like dairy products on the top. Drinks in the middle, sandwich stuff, and this is a new addition in this week's shop, Terry's Chocolate Orange, because we fancied it. And then meat on the bottom, and then veg in here. Sauce is there, and I don't know why the jam's there. Milk and mayonnaise. And then we've got these fat eggs that Ellen's mum gave to us. These are double yokers. I'm actually gonna have one of these tomorrow. Smash. Catch. 
No, no, it's cracked. Oh, oh, it has, yeah. Oh, that'd be alright. Just put him safely. And the treat drawer. Oh, yes. Treat drawer is always lit in this house. Pop chip. These are amazing. Okay. Although, I don't really like, I don't like the cheddar and onion ones. I just like the barbecue Isn't ones. Isn't it cheese and chive? Cheese and chive, yeah. Any special mentions for you? These. Oh, yeah. They're like, um, what are they called? Milky Ways. Milky Ways. Mini Milky Ways. Oh, they're just insane. And they're also really good because they're small. So you don't end up like eating loads. Another special shout out to these oh, because they are amazing. insane. They're basically I, I Crave. I actually think they're better than Crave. They do taste better than Crave. And these are good too. These little sweet chili crackers. Are you having your dinner now? Do you know where I first got those from? Where? Taz. Oh, did Taz you? Taz is obsessed with those little oh. cracker things. She's, she'll be watching this. Hi, Taz. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the roundup of your car then? Initial thoughts? Insane. Yeah? I can't believe it. Is Look it how sexy yeah it does look good mm. so is That's it what it sounds like is it what you expected it to be like more what do you mean like like the interiors lush yeah it feels so nice to drive yeah smooth do you know what fab drove it back from Lidl. do you know the first thing he did as soon as we pulled out a little <laughs> <laughs> off we went <laughs> you got to test it out didn't you i want to know does anybody else cut up a pizza with scissors? Because when I first got with Fab, I introduced you to this, didn't I? Yeah, you did. And it's actually a game changer. It is. Because you haven't got to... Yeah, when you use the, the cutter, pizza cutter, it's a bit like hit and miss, isn't it? But with the scissors... You just snip right through. Pineapple on a pizza? Uh, no. No? <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys reckon? Comment down below. Pineapple or no? Okay, or what's the weirdest thing you've ever had on a pizza? You know what's weird, but it's actually not weird, but you'll find it weird. What? Tuna on a pizza. Ew, yeah, that's quite that's quite tuna. common. Boo! <laughs> Hello everyone. Oh my god, I cannot take myself seriously. As Fab would say, yes, I have slipped and fallen in the mud again. <laughs> no, I'm joking, it's Sunday, so it's self-care Sunday, so the face mask is on. Anyway, Fab is upstairs and he is currently editing this vlog. He's been up since five o'clock this morning. I definitely was not up at that time. So, what? <laughs> but yeah, so I thought I would um, treat him and I'm gonna cook him breakfast. I'm gonna cook bagels, bacon, avocado and eggs. Now, avocado is like a new thing for us, I think. Have you always liked avocado? Yeah, I like avocado. Do you know what? It's a good job I already have a boyfriend because I tell you, if this is on YouTube, or any men are not gonna look at me twice. Right, anyway, on with breakfast. Have you eaten more of the Terry's chocolate orange? I think one bit. No, is, you've definitely had more than one bit, Fab. We were meant to be saving that. Should I turn the lights on? Oh my god, well I'm gonna do it anyway. And if you are wondering, I am in my dressing gown and I'm also in my Minnie Mouse pyjamas. I don't like things being on the side, so this corner here gives me a bit of um, the heebie-jeebies. And that's why we don't have a toaster. I'm just currently risking my life with a bread knife. Here he is. <laughs> Are you coming to save me? I, can't, I don't like vlogging on my own. <laughs> Oh god, You're good. that oh god, is that atrocious. Is dodgy cut in there. The ratio ratios are all off. I feel I feel more comfortable now that you're here. Can you stay? I'm still editing. Why have you got it so low down? I don't know. You're doing a good job, I can hear you. Ellen doesn't like vlogging on her own, but she's good at it. I look, I look like Fiona from Shrek. A little bit. Does she wear a face mask? No, she's green. Yeah, but you're not green. Um Aww. Are you making me breakfast? Yeah. I'm making you avocados, eggs, and bacon. Are you actually? I, is this for the camera? Because you never do this. <laughs> if no. I ask, usually I say, "Can you make me?" I'm just in good mood. Some hey, breakfast. Hey, no, all right. Hey, I'm not I got a good it. car now, so I have to do, have okay. to be and have more wifey points. You see. All right then. You build those wifey points. Bring them up then. Whilst I'll carry on my editing. Aww. All right. Don't. Don't mind me just slaving away working on this video that you're watching, so please leave a like because <laughs> Ellen's whipping me, making sure I'm getting it out. No, I want it out because I don't know. Yeah, this will be out on Sunday. 
So this will be, I filmed this um, this morning and you're watching it the same day. That is basically Amazon Prime. Amazon Prime. <laughs> No, it's, it's, it's same day delivery. <laughs> I think next do that. Right, anyway, on to the avocado. Gonna cut the avocado in half. I think it's ripe enough. I never know with avocados. And then I'm just gonna twist it. I mean, I'm probably explaining this and you're probably thinking, yeah, duh, Evan. Anyway, right. Ugh, what was that? There's a hair in the avocado. <gasps> Ew! This stuff is an absolute lifesaver. One calorie per spray, much better than oil. And I think it tastes nicer. Okay, well that's run out. Does cooking stress anyone else out? Because it, honestly, it makes me quite stressed. Oh God, those bagels. Okay, bagels are in. Yeah, if you put um, meals on a small plate, make sure you feel like you're eating more. Another tip you didn't ask for, but there we go. My God, that is the quickest cooking bacon you've ever seen. Ew, 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 ew. Fab's not gonna know what's hit him. I never make him breakfast. How do you even get this out of here? Oh, isn't that so satisfying? Oh no, there's a bit of shy in that one. I'm just gonna put that on to sizzle for a minute. The bacon. Oh, this is so hard. I actually think going on a cooking show would be my worst nightmare. Fab's probably going to be watching this footage back thinking, what the hell is she going on for? Well, Fab, you chose to be with me. If you ever wonder what's going on inside my mind, here it is. Ew, I don't know what's going on with this avocado, Fab. It's making me feel a bit sick. Thinking, I'm going to have a full-length documentary uh, <laughs> to edit. I know. How, I, well, I just... 18 minutes? <laughs> Want the bagels! Oh my god! They're fine. Right, let's stop this. No, 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 what? just keep it just going. Just keep going. What are you? Just keep it going because. Is this cooking with Ellen? Is no, it? No, well, I have What do you want me to do? What is going on in here? Ew, ew, I know. What uh. is that? See, cooking is nothing but stress. This looks good. It's, oh my god, it's looking good, Al. Do you want me to. Well, what do you want? Technically, you weren't even meant to see anything just yet. Bacon. He's gonna be proud of me for making this. This is what it looks like. Mmm. Okay, right, up we go. Hey! <laughs> oh, wow. Nicely done on the egg. Oh, that oh. is just the most perfectly cooked egg if you ask me. Is it good? Oh, it probably could do with some ketchup, maybe. Right, we're popping out now. I'm vlogging on the iPhone, so I don't know where you're meant to look. Is it there? There. Okay, <laughs> there. Pretty much all of our vlogs at the moment have us in the range at some point in the video, but that is the only place that is open, which is like, has a variety of stuff that you can look around. And we do actually need bits, so we are good. It is well, essential, see if they've not got really. The, but um, Boris, if you're watching this, just don't, just overlook that bit, all right? What we do want, you want I want to have a look at the garden furniture, because we are actually going to have to start buying stuff for the garden soon. And we found our grass, haven't we? Yeah, we've started mapping it out now. So we will start that series soon. Yeah, we should promise. Actually. We'll film the first episode soon. Because it's like the end of February now. Yeah, it's going to be like April, isn't God. it? You're, um, you look tiny in that seat. Because <laughs> I am tiny. Oh my God, Luke, you look good. Look. <laughs> We are, we're done in the range. We've actually got a nice little haul, haven't we? I just picked my nose. <laughs> I didn't have to pick my nose, I had Mitch. <laughs> Ellen's got a, um, a new air freshener, pink one. She just said this is a girl's car, but it's my car too. No, I say that it can go there because this is a girl's car. What about when I've got to drive it? All right, a girl's car, is it? What are you playing? Bit of digger D. Pleasantly surprised with how good home base is. It's decent, isn't it? Yeah, it's is good. You wouldn't expect it, but they've actually got some really nice, like furniture bits, um, like just home decor stuff in there. It was only yesterday that we were saying how dangerous it is to have Mackies right here. Now we are um, going to 
get Mackie's. Tell you something, we have Mackie's Mall now, we don't live anywhere near it. I know. No, I'm not no if it. you order in a Spanish accent, I will I will buy you your food. Oh, not worth it. No? Alright, then I'll do it. No! <laughs> I've seen people, I actually saw it this morning on Instagram, vanilla milkshake with, is it an espresso shot in there to make like a sort of iced coffee vibe sort of thing. I'm gonna try it because I've never tried it and it seems interesting. <laughs> Trip. I hope this is nice. That's good. God damn it! <laughs> that whole time, no mic on. Rookie mistake. So we're back from the range. We've got lots of stuff to show you, haven't mm -hmm. we? We've just <laughs> just had, had our Mackies. Mackies. <laughs> Again, oh my god. And oh yeah, we had a Mackies in the last video. Oh, it's fine. McDonald's is, is enjoyable in small doses. Um, well, we don't even have it in small doses. Shh, don't tell them that. Just okay. So we got these trays because if you didn't know, Fab has smashed our mirrored bedside table, so we need something to go over the smash. So we got these over the crack, not the smash. These little trays. We had to get two because obviously. Hey, you can see yourself. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> um, I don't know how they're gonna look. I mean, hopefully, they, hopefully. they should match the the bedside table, but. I hope so. Let's anyway, so yeah, got, them. got those. Ellen got a extension knee because we are currently um, revamping the spare room, which we haven't actually shown. Well, I don't know if we should show yet. Maybe not yet. <laughs> Do you want to talk through these? Because yeah. you made this, these were yours. So we watched um, Studio McGee. Well, and... Hold on, we're a little bit overexposed here. Here we go. So we've been watching the Studio McGee on... Oh yeah, what's it? Dream um, Home Makeover. Dream Home Makeover on Netflix. And she has got me obsessed with eucalyptus. So got a big bunch of eucalyptus and some little flowers as well to go in our new... Go on then, put them bars. in. Bars. Ellen wants this to go on the floor. I mean, we'll show you what it in looks the spare like. spare room. Looks nice though, doesn't mm. it? Look. Yeah, see? I wasn't that keen on this eucalyptus stuff, but it does I look good. It looks nice. And then, bit of a boring one, but we just got some shorter white shelves because oh, yeah. we're going to put them above our toilet in the bathroom mm. and put some decorative stuff, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, like some plants and stuff. Yeah. Because the bathroom, I think we're just not vibing We with haven't it. figured out. We need to put that white mirror up too. Yeah, we do. We figured out, because we had a black mirror in the upstairs bathroom, it was making it feel small, wasn't it? Yeah. But with, now that Ellen's not using her white mirror on her dressing table, we're going to put that up there, put these in there, and it should make it feel a bit fresher, I think. So that's that. And we also got a new outdoor mat to go <laughs> at the front door because our other one has kind of weathered the storm through winter mm. and is now looking a bit scraggy. So it we is. found like a, a more hardware and durable one, didn't we? We did. So we got that too. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed, take a second to hit the thumbs up button. And I know a lot of people that watch these videos aren't subscribed, so consider subscribing because if you hit subscribe please can you press the bell because then it will pop up and tell you that we've uploaded a new video and youtube also, is crap at notifying subscribers yeah. so also it will really help the channel and obviously with us just starting yeah we'd really appreciate it we would <laughs> also whilst you're there if you don't mind uh coming and cleaning the house for us do you know what right, right i'm done see you later guys